Yeah, I just saw um, Chester from <coughs> Lincoln Park. And I had no idea of the history of his biography. And it's just so sad. Raped from 6 to 13. And that was his life. And... I mean that that was his um story of him being angry and frustrated and a drug addict. A major, major drug addict. What <coughs> so I don't even see how you can like live. And then I'm, I was falsely accused by, you know, my so-called caretakers of being a drug addict. Like, you, you need money in order to buy drugs, in order to buy pot, okay, which I barely ever had, so. It's the biggest fucking joke. Oh, uh, all the lies that, you know, I... Just because I'm around my horrifying caretakers never did one fucking thing for me and, and, and then lie. And then, this is a, yeah, I, I can't see how all these are. Uh, like, Nicky Six should have killed himself with heroin. Hey, he did. Oh, my, let's kickstart my heart. Uh, um, how they can survive. Being major, major drug addicts, like, but Chester, it's really sad. I, I can't believe that he actually killed himself. And I'm thinking, um, I, I saw the documentary, but then there's other ones. There, there's a second one of his friend, and him, um. I don't see why he would would have killed him. Um, he, him and his second wife, I guess, were fighting a lot. I I mean, he would never have been home to see his wife or his kids. I, I but he made it as far as he had friends, so he had an okay existence that way but yeah what what can you do if you're yeah you can't control your friend if they're out I would say he hated himself because of the try I mean it wasn't him that made himself hate himself he was just uh violently um violated and he was embarrassed about it um and that ruined him but i don't no i'm interested and then they have all these other biographies there's just too like this world's just so sad it, it should never have been like i never had a place to live and I guess I'm never going to see my so-called friend again, but she's not much of a friend since she went out with all my boyfriends. I can honestly say I had never had any caretakers because, you know, I mean, a so-called caretaker actually stands up for you, and I never had that, period. But I never ever had anybody who had my back. I had children, he were taken care of so much better than I, but, you know, I mean, they, yeah, uh, what the fuck, ha what the hell happened to me? Yeah, they were taken care of so much better. Well, that's disgusting. You know, and I'm glad that I was never a drug addict. You know, um... It's just wrong that I was hurt, and in my opinion, I'm not going to remember any of my 
hell existence on Earth. Earth is hell. So, a YouTuber Morg Official is right. Like, but... He's wrong that he doesn't think that... I really do think that God tricked Satan with dying on the cross, because, uh... I personally would not have made it being sane with all of the abuse that I went through. And one of the worst abuses was pretending on narcissists. I, mean, I can't stand it because um, I might not even talk to this friend anymore. Because that's all I do. I just talk and he, um, he appreciated me, but how can you still be friends with that? But his, his life is hell. He has a mean mom, and he has not a stable environment. That's all a person needs. Just God, all I wanted was a garage to live in. You know, you know something better than that. But with all the abuse, you know, with paternal narcissists, it's better for me to live in a garage, even if that garage doesn't even have a damn sink. I, right. I can find like a public place. You know, I, I'm just saying, you know, a safe place to sleep. Uh, it's nice if you have a facility with a sink. And my, my life is just that hell. And why would I even think of this? But, you know, pretend a nurse would work against me. Oh, I just want attention and all that. Yeah. Uh... So, I'm just totally disgusted with this earth. That it's just going to get that much worse. And all these videos of food shortages. So now, you know, it's really going to be reality. And all that, you know, I mean, I don't have one person to back, to back me up. Like, my kids did, like, um... Any, but everybody I know has somebody to back them up. Oh, but maybe uh, pretend a lot narcissist friend does not. Okay, he's, that's why he listened to me in my tragedy for our... Because I'm very similar to him, but I, we can't help each other. I, it's just so sad. It's that hard. I, you know, all he needs is a decent place to live. Um, I have a place, like, for a year, but it was, like, really difficult. And, you know, I, I had to deal with a psychotic woman, uh, you know, who pretended to be my best friend. You know, that causes problems. Yeah, so, I mean, even if it, it was only, like, <clears throat> a week out of a damn month, sporadically, you know, it's still, I babysat her every month for, like, yeah. I, her pretending to be my best friend and all that, and she backstabbed me the whole time. That's how. My life is hell. I, I you know, I don't, and actually, nobody backs her up either. She had a boyfriend that took everything from her. And I, um, uh, pretend a lot. Narcissus is a great actor. He he gets churches to give to him. Oh my god! In fact, he gave his purple to alien god money, and then. His friend noticed he, he's at a church the whole day. Well, what's he doing at the church? <laughs> Lying to him. Oh, well. I, you know, this poor girl has these kids and, and she needs help. And see, the whole time, I had kids. And I needed help the entire time that he knew me. And he did nothing for me. That's right. I mean, he, he is Satan in my life. You know, it's just like, uh... You know, I needed a safe environment to live in, and, and he's a liar. Well, 
You got to live with me, Dai. You gotta live. I, I never let anyone live with me. I used, no, no. Reality is, no one can live with him because he's that psychotic. Like this woman here. Like they both were the same. Let me get you. Let me get you. I have me money. I have me money. I don't know. Why don't you just go shoot yourself? How's that? Instead of me babysitting you and you draining me of all my energy. And, and yeah, that's my life. I mean, you know, never, ever had it easy. But yeah, Jesus is real. And there's a kid, uh, King Justice, and he makes rap music. And you, you can genuinely tell. Yeah, I mean, Jesus ain't fake. I, like, yeah, he's real. You know, and I wouldn't have made it be insane without Jesus. And I, I do like real testimonies. And, I, I mean, you might be a real Jesus person and you were taught wrong of you know the old testament i don't believe in why would you believe in that shit when the vatican took over the count so morgan official youtuber does say the truth about the old testament does say the truth about but he's wrong that yeah i think a god just a good alien uh, he, nobody knows how the world started. There's just a bunch of evil aliens. And maybe one of those aliens was good and then just thought, well, maybe I could just make people out of dust. And that's what happened. I, I don't see why um, the human race would be uh, condemned to eternal hell if but now my, now, you know, I mean, real history, the Emerald Tablets, we're like 36,000 years old. There's so many damn fucking aliens, you know, I mean, at least a dozen different species. And God came from one. And maybe there was only one out of the whole species. Maybe there's only a thousand and one species of aliens. And only one was an honest one. And, yeah, I mean, basically, everybody's a liar. And everybody is a cheat and a scumbag. And in my world, I, you know, like, I don't know anyone. You know, that, you know, that has my back. That look after me, that, you know. It, it, you live in a sick world. You live in a really, really sick world. Where, I, I mean, evil reigns. And... I... Um... I'm not... Totally sure. I, I mean... It, it just sucks when you don't have... Like... <laughs> somebody there for you somebody to rely on and i never had that in my life which is sad like everybody usually can re rely on one family member one you know one decent person in their family want somebody god it just sucks to be out there all alone and no one to rely on and yeah, I had a paid counselor, and it really sucks that, you know, I, I'm fucked over so fucking bad. My health insurance has changed? What for? It wasn't supposed to get changed until October. And, oh my god, I, I fight with anybody, because there's a million people that have uh, a lot of demons. And for this really, really rotten woman... Uh, she goes and lies and says, I, I deliver, I, 
I lost everything recently, and she's like, oh, well, I, I had my own cards. Yeah, something that pretend a lot narcissists would say. Oh, she has it. She's just lying. Oh, she, you know, she just makes up stuff. And, you know, uh, what else did she, she said something really rotten against me. And that's what I hate about the small little towns. Like, where the fuck? She came from, from, from some fucking southern state. Get the fuck back. She's wicked. She's evil. There's so many wicked, evil people here. I mean, my God, the the shelter she was staying at, she was honored because she was attacking this poor other girl. And, and like, you know, people love evil. And like, oh, my God. Thinking what the hell this bitch was falsely accusing me of, of uh, another thing. Like, just, oh, my God. All these people are just so awful. It's filled with demons that just attack me. Like, yeah, I mean, this is awful. Earth is hell. I, I can't say one good thing about it. I really can't. I, I mean, and then, yeah, oh, wow, everything's going to get bad. Well, guess what? I never had a good. I never had a good. I mean, just a very few times. When my kids were small and I biked with them and I played Monopoly with them and I went hiking in the woods with them when they were real small <coughs> in a stroller. Very few good times. But, uh, and I've seen other people's lives like Chester's. I, I, I just, that really kills me. I mean, he's only 41. Holy shit. And I, it, it's just hard for me to believe that he killed himself. Like, um, the Nirvana guy. I, I do not. He did not kill himself. That was... Yeah. It, it, it's questionable. Well, oh, well, we found him dead, you know. Um, no. Uh, Whitney Houston did not kill herself. Maybe your daughter did, which is really, really sad, but... I know Whitney Houston did not kill herself. I don't know. Uh, everybody knows Michael Jackson killed himself. And if he wasn't going to get his drug Demerol from somebody, then somebody else would have gotten it for him. And he was living off of borrowed money. Uh, you know, I, I, you know, but whatever. Whatever. Uh, life is hell. There is no help out there for victims. And, it, you know, a shelter shouldn't be that hard to come by. Oh, my God. I, you know, I, it, that would be an interesting document. Like, there's no worthwhile shelters in all of the United States. I would bet, you know, that would be my bitch. Like, oh, my God, you can't even make it. When you, like, oh, well, get a job. Well, that's an issue with me. You know, I, I was lied about. And, and somebody else got my check. And my, my life is hell. It really was. It really, really was. And it, it's just so sad that there's not... There's barely anyone out there for a, a helping hand. A real helping hand. Um, if anything, back in, like, 2006, I should have been saved by somebody letting me live in their garage or you know all the other different years like it's like year after year after year i didn't want to live with with